Hey guys, what's up? This is Jay Dubroy for iGyan.in and today we'll be checking out the benchmarks on the new Galaxy Tab S. This is the 10.5 inch variant. So that means it's 10.5 inches across its screen. Uh, let's have a quick look at the specs. So to begin with, it runs on an Exynos 5 octa-core 5420 processor. It has a 3 GB RAM and a 7900 milliampere battery. This also has a rear camera of 8 megapixel and a front camera of 2.1 megapixels. Let's quickly run a quadrant test which will give us a better idea about the hardware on this tab. Quick look at the system information. So we can see this runs on an Android 4.4.2 which is your latest version of Android. The model number is an SMT805 and uh, we have an ARM 7 processor in this and a speed of 1500 megahertz which is quite good and a total memory of 3 GB RAM. In terms of the display, we have a 2560 by 1600 resolution, a 286 by 286 DPI and a refresh rate of 60 Hz. It has a Mali T628 GPU and you can also check out uh, the VBO and the other extensions. Finally, we'll have a quick look at the sensors. So as you can see, this has the accelerometer sensor, the gyroscope, the magnetic uncalibrated light sensor and a bunch of other sensors which you can pause the screen and have a look at. We'll quickly run a full benchmark on this tab, which will give us a better idea of how this tablet performs. So there you have it guys, the scores are in. It scored a 21,553 on the quadrant, which is quite impressive. Impressive in terms of its CPU and even its memory input output. Next, we'll quickly run an AND22 test. So a score of 34,270 on the N22, again pretty impressive. You can have a quick look at the details. Next guys, we'll run the Nina Mark II test, which will give us an idea about the graphics on this tab, how that plays out. So this device scores a 59.8 FPS on the Nina Mark, which is about as high as it gets on a Samsung device, pretty impressive. Finally guys, we'll end with a multi-touch test, which will give us an idea as to how many fingers this tablet can accept. So we've already run this test before, but for you guys, it's a 10 finger multi-touch. That's all we got for you from the specs and the benchmarks. This is Jaya Dubroy signing out. If you liked our video, please leave a comment. You can also follow us on iGeon.in or on Facebook, Twitter and Google+.